Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I have a hair review for you guys. I was sent this hair from a company called Wonder Girl Hair Company. Um, and they sent me a 16 inch frontal and three um, 18 inch um, bundles of body wave hair. Um, I'm not sure if it's Brazilian or Peruvian hair because they didn't really tell me. Um, but I know it's virgin hair, um, obviously because I colored it. Um, but yeah, we'll get into that in a second. Um, okay, so to make this wig, I used one and a half of the bundles and the frontal. Um, the reason why I did it that way is because usually I use like three bundles, but for my other wigs, whenever I cut them, I noticed that the ends are usually too thick for me and I knew that I was going to cut this um, for this hairstyle so that's why I only used um, one and a half bundle and also I didn't double the tracks usually I double the tracks this time I only um, used the single tracks or whatever and yeah so that's why I only use a little bit of hair so it lays really flat and whatnot this hair is so flowy like <sighs> um but yeah i really i'm really liking it um okay for the color now so the color that i wanted is not what i got but it's okay though um but the colors that I used, so basically I be piling up colors, like sometimes I'll, from like old um, hair or wigs or whatever that I've colored, um, sometimes I have leftover color and I had like an orangish color leftover and so I just went out and I bought another orange color and a red because I wanted it to be like red orange. But what I should have done is should I should have just got all one color because I realized that it came out more red than orange. Um, but the colors that I used was paprika and crimson red, and the other color that i had left over was sunrise orange even though i don't think that mixing all those colors actually did anything um i feel like the red color um came through more than anything um so it's not really on the orange side it's more on the red side but it's okay i still like it so um well i'm still getting used to it but um so far i really like this hair um the only thing that i will say is that it shed a lot it shed like a lot especially like when i finished bleaching the hair the frontal shed a lot but it was because um i had bleached the knots first and then when i had gone over it to bleach the um frontal um it got on the knots so i feel like because it was double bleach it um shed a lot um but it's still very full like even though it shed so much the frontal is still full um and that's all for this hair i think i really like it i'm going to update you guys in like two weeks of how i feel about this hair i don't even know if i'm gonna leave it on for two weeks i'm probably gonna leave it like take it on and off um depending on how i'm feeling <laughs> i don't know i'm gonna try to like make this a month thing and like you know stick with this hairstyle but I'm not sure um what I plan on doing with my hair next so but this is gonna be my hairstyle for a little bit um but yeah I like it it took the color really well um I bleached it I only had to bleach it once um I only bleached it like light, light enough for it to take the color um so when I bleached it it turned it was like it was like honey blonde i didn't bleach it light enough for it to be like a platinum blonde or anything but it does take color so um that's how i know it's version here um and it took the color really well and it's so soft just sheds right now i'm not 
I, I don't know if it just sheds when I brush it because right now I'm not really getting that much hair. I don't know. I feel like it shed more when it was in its natural state, but once I straightened it, it didn't, it stopped shedding as much. And um, yeah, that's it. I'm gonna make an updated video in like two weeks. Um, don't hold me to it but um maybe the end of the month yeah the end of the month is in two weeks so yeah two weeks. um but yeah that's all for this video and i hope it was informative if you guys would like the link to in the description box and all that good stuff so stay tuned for my next video